Welcome back to Extra Holiday Games. I'm Extra Holiday and going in the pipe for the umpteen billionth time. Yes, yes, we all love ah, how long it's taking me to beat this. It's great, truly wonderful. Boink. Eh, boink. Yeah, it's, 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 it's a really a thing, you know, it's really a thing. This, this here level. It is something to behold in its difficulty. Yeah, you hit yourself. <laughs> kind of, uh, kind of not exactly proving my point there, but, uh, okay. I was, I kind of got a little sidetracked. I'm a little tired right now. I don't normally record after work, but I kind of threw my schedule off earlier this week so okay cool very very cool I'm just gonna I'm just gonna play aggressive yeah I I kind of missed a recording day so I'm trying to make it up on a day that I don't normally record and so yeah I'm, I'm, a, little, I'm, a, little, I'm a little sleepy and I killed myself good good yeah probably not gonna be seeing top tier play Hello, Doctor. No, this isn't the time for you to climb up on my lap. Nope. Down. Good boy. Oh, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta focus on. Well, I was gonna say focus on the game, but uh, we all know that's not what I do here. <laughs> no, what I do is focus on literally anything but the game. So I guess I could have a dog on my lap, but it's fine. The dog's a little, a little too clingy for my liking. I think I've discussed it before, why I prefer cats over dogs, and ultimately it just comes down to the, the that thing, the, the clinginess. How most dogs that I know, and some are better than others, but most dogs that I know have to be like, at the very least, right next to you, if not totally on top of you like they gotta be within petting distance at all times and that can be rather inconvenient and it can get rather annoying particularly when you when every time you step out of your room they are at your feet plus you know small dogs especially you take one wrong step and that's that's a big problem, you know. So, yeah. And cats, generally you don't have that problem. Because they only, uh, they only come to see you when they want something from you. And dogs just always want something from you. <laughs> so I guess it's, you know, both of them only come to see you when they want something. It's just dogs always want something. And that's generally your attention. Speaking of dogs, yeah, they're, they're, they're barking now, which is great. They tend to do that during daylight hours. Which is, is I mean, it's, it's also one reason I don't really like these dogs that much. Ahem. I don't usually record during daylight hours, partly because of dogs barking. I am, I'm, I'm making do with what I can here, because it just, it just didn't work out my recording day, my last recording day, you know, it just, it just didn't work out. So, we are uh, doing what we can. And frankly, frankly, again, nobody's actually paying this close of attention to my channel, but <laughs> if you are, uh, you may have noticed that there were two episodes of Bloodborne in a row. That's because I missed my recording day. I, I didn't get to recording this until just now. And so I didn't have another episode of, uh, of Mario Maker ready for that, for the day it was supposed to go up. So I replaced it with a Bloodborne episode because I actually recorded like two batches worth of Bloodborne episodes last time. 
which is, uh, which meant that, you know, theoretically I could have waited till my next recording day to record this, but that would mean, you know, like five episodes of Bloodborne in a row, or I think it would have even been seven. So yeah, it would have been a lot of episodes of Bloodborne in a row. And I didn't want to do that because I don't, because, you know, I don't want to make anyone who's waiting for Super Mario ep or Maker episodes that, again, I don't know if there's actually anyone in that group, but anyone who might be, I don't want to make them wait. You know, who knows when the day is that someone will actually start watching this series day or, you know, episode to episode, you know, when they come out. Who knows? Could be any day. So because of that, you know, I just, I just want to keep, I just want to keep the schedule steady, you know? I mean, it's not the end of the world. It's not the end of the world that I had to put two episodes of Bloodborne in a row, but it is not ideal either. Okay, here we go. Now I can just do this for a bit. Frick, I landed. Wasn't supposed to land there. Okay, cool. <laughs> I'm stuck in place by the ice because I was trying to gain traction, but it wasn't working. It's fine. Ultimately, it's fine. All right, here we go. Yeah, I mean, that's, uh, that's, that's been a big part of my life lately. How you doing? Good, good, bad, other? However it is, I hope it's good. I hope. Because honestly, I don't really care who you are. I don't wish ill on anyone. Like even people who most would consider bad people. And that's largely because, as I understand it, people who doing bad things do it because they themselves have had bad things done to them, or they're they're in a spot where <laughs> they're in a bad spot themselves. Why did I spin jump there? Uh, so ultimately, if you just make things worse for them, it's just not really gonna make things. It, it's not really gonna make them change their ways. They're just gonna keep doing what they were doing because the whole reason they were doing that in the first place. It's because things already sucked. Oh, okay. Well, I was trying a new technique there. It didn't work. Dog door. Anyway. <clears throat> yeah. It's just a... I, I'm, I'm pretty sure I've given that the full spiel there before, but that's the short version. More succinct version. It, Honestly, I'm a little distracted. I'm a little distracted. And I'm a little, yeah, I, I, you can probably tell I'm a little off my game right now. Both the literal game and the talking into a mic game. Yeah, and that's just because I, I'm tired and I've got a, there's, there's a lot more stuff going on than there usually is, you know. And I hadn't really think, thought about it before until I just started recording just now. That is kind of a big thing, you know. And I, in, in hindsight, it makes sense. It makes more sense of a decision I had already made, you know, in deciding to try and record when everyone else is asleep or not around it allows me to focus more on the content that I am making rather than what's going on around me and I can feel comfortable doing that without uh, without having to having to worry so much about whatever else is happening mm -hmm. so yeah 
think that's, uh, that's, that's, that's a neat little lesson I have learned uh, from trying to record right now. So I'm glad I did it. I am glad. Because now I feel like I am uh, more informed of my own, even of my own decisions. It really, uh, it's really reinforcing my reasoning for doing things the way I did them. And you know, we, we all love to hear, <laughs> we all love to hear that we're uh, doing things correctly, particularly from ourselves. How did I miss his head? How did I miss it? That was lame. Lame. Yeah, whatever. Whatever. What? This is gonna be a short patch, I can already tell. <laughs> Cause, uh... Yeah, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Uh... And I really, I really don't have much to talk about right now. I mean, I do, but I don't at the same time, you know. There's a lot that's happened, but it's not, it's not really stuff I'd want to bring up on the show. So I'm, uh, I'm kind of at a loss here, you know. It's, it's a weird, weird position to be in. I will say, I recently found out, because I was looking, I was looking into some ways that potentially I could uh, up my game here again. Well, mostly, I was, was going to say again, both in, in both ways, but actually no, it's, it's mostly just in the uh, talking into the mic variety. And I learned, right, I recently, I recently downloaded the uh, Reddit app. I'm sure many of you are familiar with. Um, I recently downloaded Reddit to my phone. And, you know, I made a Reddit account and all that. Because I've actually been trying to cautiously get into social media a little bit more. So yeah, I have a Reddit account now and I, I'm trying to post a little more on Twitter and that's, that's really all I'm doing. But I found out last night, I believe. But I found out that there is a subreddit for Let's Plays. And I went and I looked at it. And I was like, mostly what I was looking for. Okay, nice. Mostly what I was looking for was just a, a place to advertise. Because, you know, I'm... Here's the thing. I'm not above advertising my channel when I know that it's welcome. But the thing is, when I was looking at this Let's Play Reddit, one of the rules is specifically it, it, it's not for self-promotion, which is, which I'm like, okay, I, I get it. It's not what I'm looking for. I won't try and force that up on this place that clearly does not want that. So. I, but I just thought it was interesting, you know, I thought it was interesting that, and it makes sense, right? I mean, it's the internet, there's a place for just about everything, right? But I thought it was interesting that there is actually a place for, you know, Let's Players to actually talk about what they're doing. And, you know, maybe I'll frequent that subreddit a little more, and maybe I won't. But I did see some interesting stuff, like there was someone who was seemingly quite new to Let's Playing. It was like, they were posting something like, man, I really, okay, cool. <laughs> they were posting something like, man, I thought it was gonna be really weird talking to myself into a mic. But like after the first couple episodes, it didn't really feel that weird. And I, I was like, yeah. Actually, when I read that, I was like, yeah, that's about how it went for me, too, right? I did the one test episode that I didn't upload and I'm never going to upload. 
Uh, but I did that one test episode just to get the feel for it. And that was really awkward and really weird. And I was like, oh, what am I doing? But afterward, I felt like a little better about it. And so I went and I recorded an actual episode. You know, the first actual episode, which the first episode I recorded, I don't remember if it's the first one I posted, but uh, or uploaded. But the, uh, the first episode I recorded definitely was the uh, Pokemon Battle Revolution episode one. Which is, as I have stated before, one of my most viewed videos on this channel. <laughs> and it was, uh, yeah, and after that point, after that first episode, after those first couple episodes that I post uploaded, you know, the first couple episodes of Battle Revolution, basically by the time I started recording Gravity Rush, which was the next game I played and I, I was playing, I still had the same schedule of releasing a game every other day and then you know, alternating between games. I I was doing that back then as well. And so the the alternation was between Battle Revolution and Gravity Rush, so of course I recorded Gravity Rush not long after. I recorded the first batch of Gravity Rush before I recorded the second batch of uh, Battle Revolution. I should say that. that That's probably the easy, easiest way to put it. So... Yeah, by the time I recorded Gravity Rush, I was feeling actually pretty comfortable just talking to myself with a mic in front of me. And it's been that way ever since, really. It's a, it's a, it's a strange skill to have, but it's, it's nice to know that it is something that I can, in fact, do. So, I'm glad. I'm glad. And I can relate to that one Redditor on r slash let's play. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, I was really trying to dodge the fireball there, but it did not work. Okay. You know what? There was like a little gap I could get through there. But maybe I'll get through the gap next time. Because uh, as for this episode... That's a wrap. like medium-sized dogs.